Hi, y'all. Uh, y'all know I like sharing how to save money, right? Especially on food, everything, everyday things. So I'm going to share with you my Amazon haul. Um, so I did read the full information about the um, $50 off a hundred plus dollar order. Um, it has to be on your account. Even if it's not on your account, I would still say try to use the Fresh 50. I posted it in my community tab. So, yes. Um, I will be going over the pricing with y'all. Um, some of these things did have coupons like 10% off. There was like three things that had coupons. But let me go over it with you. How it states it here is the price after the 50% off and the coupons. So, first I got... Oh, <laughs> four distilled waters four of them because of my CPAP machine I have to have um, distilled water so four of those came up to two dollars and 42 cents I basically saved half almost it was two dollars and 34 cents uh, like adjusted or with like debited so we're just going to go through here now one thing I want to mention I picked it up so via pickup on the app whatever it did not ask for a tip they don't ask for a tip while there that's amazing um you know you hear about so many people so many companies every single time you order something they want a tip you go to the coffee shop they ask hey do you want to leave a tip everything asks for a tip here it did not i know i have ordered amazon fresh in the past and had it delivered like twice because of of a sale and they do ask for a tip obviously for the driver i picked this up myself it is at the same location where i used to work at um, if you guys know i used to work for amazon fresh it used to be amazon prime now but yeah it's not too far um so yeah i just went there the guy um if you like let them know that you're on your way once you get there you let them know that you're there you put the color of your car they come out they'll load it up I asked the guy, do they accept tips there? And he was like, yeah, but you don't have to. So I gave him the little bit of cash I had on me, which was $3. So when you don't ask for it, it means that I'm giving, you know, <laughs> that I, that makes more sense to me. So anyways, y'all might as well be happy about this. A party size of spicy nacho burritos. Let's see, that price, y'all know those things cost like $9. It's crazy. That was $3.30, so I guess in all, it would have been like $6 and $6 and like 50 cents. So not too bad. So that was $3.50. You can get a smaller bag for like $5 at these regular stores. I will say, you know, Amazon is good with the pricing. Some things are good. Some things are bleh. <laughs> Now, y'all will see a multitude of different things here. So, um, next up, next bag is this. And they do wrap the meat up in these things just in case if, um, you know, it get a rip or something um so yeah i ended up getting this right here this is some ground beef this is 80 20 lean if you guys could see that and these are a pound each yeah these are a pound each so this is a value pack so this is three pounds all together want to make like some tackles um and stuff like that so that price was seven dollars and 63 cents uh so very like kind of still high but you figure it would have been like what 14 15 dollars 14 80 at the end of it um that's kind of high for me, but seeing that I was using a 50% off coupon, it made sense for me to go ahead and pick it up. Um, I don't, I have shrimp in the freezer. I don't have much of anything else right now besides like 
frozen stuff, okay? Um, living my best life of not really cooking. <laughs> the next thing I got was this right here, Tyson's Rotisserie Seasoned. So we'll see how this tastes. I don't know. But yeah, we got this. And this is a 2.5 pound, 2.5 pound chicken breast. Watch out, Luna. Those are like the only meats I bought, you guys. Um, because I still see me and Jamez being kind of wasteful with things. So, yeah. Uh, that came up to $5.84. Let me get the big thing out the way, which I was like, I might as well stock up. You know, when you're shopping, it's just like you don't know what to get because <laughs> you it wasn't like in this was not in the plans. Um, but I'm like, you know, tissue was good. So we got a 20 pack, sorry, a 20 pack of Scott's tissues. I know a lot of people don't like that one. I love it, uh, especially when you're in an apartment, even at a house, it doesn't clog your toilets. So, yeah. So, I ended up getting that. Um, that itself was, I'm so hungry <laughs> right now. That was $9.32. So, that's really good. You figure, I bought 12 packs of those. Of, yeah, the 12 pack. And it was at the store at, at a good sale of what $8.99 yeah $8.99 at like Lidl a couple weeks back and I got two of those so you figure I got basically almost double the amount for half the price right so really really good this is the last bag Reynolds wrap heavy duty Heavy duty, okay? So I ended up getting this, and this is 130 square feet. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, So yeah, I got that. And I like to obviously use that for when I'm, if you guys have seen my pans and stuff, um, they're rusty, so I always line it with aluminum foil. And obviously the heavy duty is a good, 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 a regular is good too, but, like, even when I make cakes and stuff, yeah, um, we use aluminum foil in there, too. I can't keep going out buying these pans and glass stuff. Mm -mm. <laughs> All right. So, that itself was $5.40. This one did, did have an additional coupon. I forgot what it was, like 20% off. So, I did get $7.89 off of that. That is a really good price. A really, really, really good price. So happy with that. And for it to be heavy duty. Oh, oh I didn't know these were organic, but organic bananas. A uh, bushel. This was 70 cents. Oh, it does say organic on there. So yeah, not too bad. 70 cents. <clears throat> Now, this is for me and my sweet tooth. You guys know I'm in my mood right now. So, <laughs> I got some Laffy Taffy. Strawberry, banana, sour apple grape. That itself was $1.46. Even better because it's bigger than when you go to the Dollar Tree. A couple other candies. Let me bring those all out at once hold on okay candy time <laughs> sour patch kids this was 54 cents Sweetest fish. These are like the movie size ones, you guys. You know, um, I think this was this one was 60 cents. This one, which is the um black raspberry, this one was 54 cents. And I got some gummies. Don't don't judge. Don't judge. 
<laughs> gummies, Amazon gummies, Amazon fresh gummies. Um, this was 86 cents. And this one did have like an additional coupon. I got a dollar three off of that one altogether. Um, the other candies, they were just half price off. Next thing up, what is this? I don't remember what this one is. Oh. Oh, okay. So. Give me a moment. Let's go to the next thing. So I'm going to have to check that other one out. Um. So, versus me. Oh, man, Candace. Darn it. This is foaming hand soap. I thought I was getting like regular hand soap, but it says five times uh, on there, like refill five times about, and this one is fragrance free. Um, <clears throat> man, Candace. Okay. Let me, let me go over this with y'all. Hold on. That was $5 and 84 cents. Uh, that's a 64 fluid ounce. Um, I do have some, I do believe I still have some, um, you know, use, like, you know, you buy foaming hand washes, you keep, you keep the, the, um, the pumps, you keep it, right? I do that just because I like to refill them from time to time versus the bar soap. Sometimes I go from bar soap, sometimes I'll go to the pump. I know I have one. Um, so I'll keep that one probably down here in the kitchen area. And I still have like the liquid refill, not of this, but a different liquid refill upstairs. So we're good with that. But that was $5 and 84 cents. And the last thing was definitely for me again. And we'll see if Jamez wants some too. <clears throat> but this one is supposed to be, let me see. Oh, nine of them. Nine of them. Burt's Bees. I like this one because the first ingredient is beeswax. I have some other these and they start off with like sunflower oil and they're like super oily. I like the one that start off with beeswax. Um, So this one is just, just the beeswax, vitamin E and peppermint. So these were... This was super good price, super good price. Do you know these, one of these usually costs around like $3. I got these for like $1.50 a piece. So uh, all together, I got nine, nine of them for $7.23. Give me a moment. <clears throat> nine of them. Oh, okay. So there's three of them out here. I'm so happy about that. Winter and summertime, you know, so good. Jamez said he doesn't like it because it's too cakey. I love it. You don't have to put too much on, but I like to because you, if you guys don't know, I put lotion on before I did this, but I get super dry, y'all, super dry. And that's what I was worried about. I'm like a box. So let's make sure there's six other ones in here. And there is. Okay, cool. So, you see, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, they just said, hey, I might as well keep it in the box. There's six of them in there. So, yeah. So, let me do this. So, that's my entire haul. You see, it's a mixture of things. I wasn't really planning on buying anything, but it is what it is. Um, you know, I didn't really need too much food food. And plus, we our freezer is packed with, like, breakfast sandwiches uh, saving money on that versus going out in the morning. Um, we got bread and like fries and chicken nugget, like chicken nugget patty or chicken patty, spicy patties. So that's what we've been making. Not the best. We need to eat some vegetables, but don't judge. Um, so yeah, once again, for all nine of those that came up to $7 and 23 cents.
OMG, when, as I mentioned, usually one of those costs like $3. It's ridiculous. So all together, um, we went over the pricing. My bill was $104.53. Um, total a total before tax, um, a total after tax was $106.48 promotions because I did state that three of these things had like promote like a coupon attached um was fifty two dollars and eighty five cents so my grand total for everything was fifty three dollars and sixty three cents so okay so oh I only had two coupons the promotions applied was the fifty off of a hundred um there was a nineteen cent coupon and then the last coupon was for two dollars and sixty six cents which had to be for that aluminum foil, but here you go, y'all. Oh, let's see. I don't know. Can y'all even see that? I don't know. And there goes the coupons. But yeah, y'all, let me know if you guys will be doing it. I think it's really, really good for everything I got. Um, you know, between meats, you know, we can, that's four dinners at least, well, more than four dinners. We've got four pounds of beef or three pounds of beef. We have a little, what, a little bit over two pounds of chicken. Uh, we have canned foods. We do have some frozen vegetables as well. So we got to get back into that. Um, but you know, getting stocked up on toilet tissue, getting Jabez something that's that's the Doritos basically for him getting some household items getting stuff for me getting personal items that chapstick I could actually keep one in the car um I have one up no the other ones I have are not the thick one um I have one thick one left which is in my purse and then the other one I there's two other ones I have upstairs but I don't really like to use them because there's they don't do much for me. <laughs> Jamez probably would like it, but I don't. But uh, yeah, there we go, you guys. I think that was super, super good. Let me know. What would you have bought? Have you checked your account? Will you be doing it? Will you be picking it up? Or will you be having somebody come? I was like, I'm going to take full advantage of the $50 versus me giving back $10 or five, seven dollars back to somebody to drive it to me. You know, it wasn't, it's not far from my house. So you think about those things. Do you usually get deliveries? I know some people usually get deliveries. So you're probably used to the fees. Um, myself, I don't wanna pay no tip. I don't wanna pay nothing. I think in the past, I know with Amazon, they don't charge you, oh, they may charge you for delivery. Um, if it's like expedited or something like that, or if it's not a certain amount, I think now it's only a hundred dollars to get it for free shipping, but you still would want to probably tip somebody, right? So yeah, there we go. Talk to you guys soon. As you guys know, I'm always trying to share ways of saving some money, hard times. I'm going to talk with y'all soon because there's some stuff I need to catch y'all up on and yeah, talk to you soon. Bye.